I want you guys to think about when you're using the kettlebell. The first exercise that we're going to do is we're going to press it to the ceiling. When you're holding a kettlebell, what you want is you want a strong wrist. Now check out Kate. What I want you guys to look at is see how she's holding this kettlebell. Notice how everything is nice and strong. She has a fist and she's going to push it to the top just like this. Now, you don't want your wrist to break at all. You don't want that to break because then you're going to create a lot of impingement here as well as in the shoulder when you're pressing that overhead. So you want to stay strong. It's going to take practice and it's going to take a lot of just endurance on the wrist as you get stronger. That's why we're starting with 10 reps. As you get stronger, you can do more repetitions, you can do more weight, all those good things. Yeah, don't be surprised if when you first start using a kettlebell, you notice irritation here. Sometimes even as you're trying to train yourself and learn how to use it, don't be surprised if you get some bruises and stuff here. But over time, that will get better. But it's just part of, it's part of the process. So, strong wrist. Yeah, okay, okay. so let's go ahead. And